I just really appreciated all of it, like the food, the program, the stretching, the massage, just the whole vibe. I felt mentally healthy, physically healthy. Being able to talk about surf with people that don't get bored about talking about surf is really technical but it was very visual. So we would see the videos and we would get the coaching. And, you know, I think we have a foundation, a way that we can get better, a way that we can enjoy it and then, and then work our way through it. And then uh, we'll eventually come back here and try it all again. Feels like a once in a lifetime trip. You don't have to be carrying your phone around. We get pictures of me and Talia the whole time. So now we have these memories of us out on the water that we would never have. It was super impactful. We both feel like we want to grow in this sport and we get to share it together and we get to be in this community. It's energizing. It's a part of life that I think we would love to do again and again. <laughs>
one that's behind you, we're probably gonna have to move our feet back and then go for the turn. And it was nice because I always felt like I could trust her, but she definitely pushed us to where she knew we could do. If I thought a wave was too steep, she would be like, just go, don't think, just go. And every time I went, I would catch it and it would be the best wave ever. She was the perfect combination of like light bulb moments and just positivity. I have 30 years of self-taught surfing and now I'm learning how to surf correctly. Will um, was my coach this week. Working with him um, allowed me to see where my body weight and where I'm looking, how high I'm angling my takeoff. We have the same coach, so we were all speak. Um, well, first I started off with Derek. He was just so like encouraging and positive that I think it just started me off on a good foot. And then Ollie, I don't even know what to say. He's just an incredible teacher. He was an amazing communicator. He was like emotionally there, technically there. We just, I can't, I could go on for a thousand years. He's, he's one of those people that can really break down why you're making mistakes and give you tools to work on them. And I felt like he read our minds a lot in terms of yeah. where we were, our mood. Honestly, it was such a blessing to have him. I have Gabriel. He was so special. Um, first of all, I think to start with a beginner, why am I getting emotional? <laughs> I just imagine to really have the patience to sit with someone who knows nothing and to really walk through that. It was just, it was really special. He was so, so attentive and like I just always felt like he had my back but he was somehow not just making me feel comfortable on the surfboard he was making me feel comfortable in this environment where I I don't know myself right so he was just such a champion and I just feel like he was my number one fan all the way through and always inviting me to dance at the end of, <laughs> at the end of all of my waves so it was great it was special. Yeah, it really was. I loved my coach so much. He loved his coach. I think everyone was happy with who they were paired with. They managed to be really technical and like tell us all these things we wanted to correct without making it this like heavy, you're doing stuff wrong. Like there was just kind of a beautiful balance of like have fun and still work on these things that I think was really very much appreciated. We've had such a great group. Um, and I think a special one. We've had really deep conversations and shared things about our personal lives. I mean, it's fascinating. We're, what, 10 people that have never met each other, and there was just so much commonality. You know, I don't think there was ever a point where we felt like there wasn't something to talk about. And what was cool about it is as the trip progressed, everybody was cheering for everybody else. Somebody would get a wave, everybody would you know, put their hands up and scream. So unique because then you genuinely are so happy for everyone when they improve too. Everyone was awesome. And I love that there was another daddy-daughter group. Like Mia and Michael being here was amazing because now we know that they go to Boca once a year and now we can hang out with them outside of here, which I think is really great. I, I think it's an energy. I think it's people that come with you and encourage you as you continue to practice something that you love to do. So whether it's the coaches and the, the people that you met, I mean, we've, we've all just shared information and hope to see each other again and surf with each other again. It's tools that we can work on and relationships that keep us engaged and sort of inspired to continue the sport.